One thing that I find fascinating is the discipline of the game. What are some of the lessons you've learned as far as the discipline of it? Because, I mean, sure, there's the working out, there's the consistency, there's the, the mindset. It seems to me that once somebody flips the switch, yeah. there's a different internal furnace yeah. that starts, that pulls them, the vision of their future pulls them yep. through the discipline. For sure. When somebody else is just like, oh, drag, you know, they're, <laughs> yeah. they, they, they're trying to push through yeah. the discipline. It feels to me like any elite, I think commitment to that discipline is kind of required, yeah? I think it turns into an, I'm like an obsession. Yeah. It turns into an obsession and we don't mind going through the hurt and the pain of whatever it's going to take to get to our goal. Yeah. You know, pretty much. The pull is too strong. Yeah, the pull is too strong. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what we have to go through. But we know in our mind and back of our mind that we're going to get a prize at the end of the You're already going through the pain. Yeah. You might as well just go over here and get a prize for it. And that's the prize of of, of just becoming you know, Olympic champion or, or world boxing champion or whatever the case may be. Yeah, I, th I think we're talking about excellence. Yeah. You know, what does it take to be excellent? I think obsession is one of the requirements. It has to And be. the world... <laughs> judges anybody who has that level of fanatical dedication yeah, to a goal for sure even though anybody at elite level yeah or anything great that's ever been built or any company that's ever been created so required that it required did it. you ever take any heat over your level of obsession or was it mostly rewarded you know, when you were growing up and when you're in your formative years? I got a lot of heat for sure because a lot of people, um, you know, my small hometown, they didn't understand it. Mm. They didn't understand it because they've never seen anybody, especially around our area, to to possibly reach that point. Your parents ever take any heat? Oh, you're not letting him be oh, a kid. Oh, all the time. You know, you're not especially, letting him be a kid. Let, let, let him just be a kid. He doesn't need to be trained all the time. Especially as a Haitian, uh, uh, you know, like especially Haitian parents, because they came over here with a group of other Haitian, um, you know, immigrants on these boats and, and you know, they made it wear out and, and they got a chance to kind of, you know, get in a you know, position to have a family and mm -hmm. to have a house and to work. They got all of the heat from the Haitians that came over in the community. Judgment. Tons. What the hell are you doing? You yeah, leave you those kids with, alone. You came all the way over here to the United States, almost died on the way. Now you got your kid over here fighting in, running in the sun in the gym. He needs to go to school to be a doctor, lawyer. Like, what are you doing? They got that nonstop. What are they? How was they? How did they respond? Oh, my dad didn't care. You know, he was. I mean, he was. A, I know what I'm doing. Like I said, my dad was a pit bull. You know, he was like the leader of. Is he still around or no? No, he just passed. I don't know how long it's been now, Porsche. Uh, it's been probably three years, three four, four years. years. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. sorry to hear it. Yeah. That's the one thing we have. He's definitely, you know, left that fire the in pit all bull of us. In, you. in all of us. Yeah, all that's great. What a legacy. Businesses. Yeah, man. So, so he didn't care about any of that. Good. Know, <laughs> he knew. Uh, he knew that we were on the greater things, and yeah, and it panned out to be that. Got to be pretty proud, man. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. If you like this video and you'd like to see more, please make sure that you subscribe to this channel. We post new content every single day. If you're into network marketing, entrepreneurship, or personal development, this is the channel for you.